Today YouTube, it's Shane here once again and today I'm at the Royal Adelaide show and uh, I'm nearly finished for today and uh, the weather it started raining really heavily and I'll show you some footage of that after I, after this bit but yeah um, yeah so I'm enjoying working at the show uh, today someone called me a few swear words unfortunately uh, putting a dampener on uh, an otherwise excellent uh, royal show if you are ever in Adelaide South Australia do come along to the uh, the Royal Adelaide show held in uh, September every year it goes for uh, like two weeks a week or two and uh, it's fantastic it's like a massive state fair and I've got a job of uh, cleaning the beef cattle and uh, it's a different area for me but I've done it before uh, but it's something uh, interesting the the supervisor's great very lenient uh, and uh, very supportive and uh, yeah so when this guy complete stranger just started uh, harassing me calling me every name under the sun including the c-word uh, a few f-bombs as well uh, I just said hey don't speak to me that way and I got a commandment from, for saying that and um, yeah so th the people here like really backed me up so that's awesome as well uh, yeah and uh, I had a comedy gig stand-up gig at the uh, Crown and Anchor Hotel it went really well I stuffed up uh, most of my act I had um, I stumbled. Uh, just the you know, your mind goes blank under the stress stress of it all, and I couldn't remember the word eyes. Um, when you see my act, you, you know what I'm talking about. But um, yeah, but the audience reaction to what I was doing was amazing, and they were very supportive as well. And um, yeah, and it allowed me to learn a lot more stuff about comedy and about myself. Strange, it's a strange thing, uh, standing up on stage in front of an audience and getting stuck and getting lost in your act and going off the rails. Uh, it teaches you a lot about yourself and it taught me a lot about my act and I think that I was struggling because a lot of it, most of it was written for me by somebody else, based on my ideas, but they fleshed it out. And then I realized that really I need to be more authentic with myself and stuff like that. But anyway, you don't want to hear about that too much. I'll talk about that next time. But listen to the rain. It's been going on, this video is about three minutes, but the rain's probably started about five minutes before I started recording but um, yeah I will leave you with some uh, heavy rain footage at the Wavell Showgirls. <laughs> Look after yourselves, bye for now.